My name is uh, Jonathan Whistler. I'm the general manager for Europe and Middle East region uh, for a company called SoftLayer. Which services do you offer? So we have a, uh, a hosting platform. So we offer dedicated servers and cloud servers uh, and what we call private and public cloud. And we have the, through our platform, it's a very automated platform, you have the ability to deploy dedicated servers in one to four hours, cloud instances in five to 15 minutes. And given we have 13 data centers across the globe, you can deploy a global environment in, a less, than an, in less than a few hours. Are people very interested in the cloud? Or do they rely on, on putting their data into the cloud? They do, so and one of our advantages is we have a hybrid environment, so you can have dedicated servers for something like your database, and then you can spin up web instances in the cloud via whether it's public or private, and people are very interested because it gives you that flexibility, not only on the infrastructure side, the server and network side, but also on the billing side, so you can only pay for what you use. You provide your services only for companies or also, or also for private people? Uh, mostly for companies, so we're an infrastructure as a service, uh, but it doesn't have to be a large company. You can order just one server. We don't do long-term contracts, so our longest contract is 30 days, so if someone wants to come in and have a server, they can use it for 30 days, three months, six months, and then turn it off. So we have a range of customers. It ranges from small one or two server orders to large companies that need very global, scalable infrastructure. Uh, do people use your service usually only for 30 days, or do they usually say, okay, I'll take it for half a year, a year? Well, it depends. I mean, our philosophy is we need to make you happy every month. So we have a lot of customers that come in and they, they stay with us for years, right? So we have some long-term customers. We have some customers that they just might need the infrastructure for 30 days or 90 days. So they'll have the infrastructure and then turn it off when they, when they don't need it anymore. So it depends. What are your first impressions here at the World Hosting Days? Uh, it's been very productive. I always come to these things for the people, so we met some of our partners, we met some of our customers, we've gotten some good feedback and uh, some new, uh, new opportunities as well. So it's been quite nice. What do you think is most challenging in the industry regarding the future? That's a great question. I mean, there are, there are a lot of challenges in the industry. I think education is one of those, so people have a question about what the cloud is and how the cloud can be beneficial for them. Um, and I think that's an education process and a comfort process, so people understand that I can have this flexibility, but I can have the security and I can have the control. So that's what people are afraid of. They don't want, they want to have the flexibility and they want to have the scalability, but they don't want to lose control. So I think one of the ways we're seeing that are people building platforms as a service, right? So the, the servers and the network, you know, you can anyone can build those out, but you need to have a technology platform that enables you to have control without giving, without sacrificing the business flexibility. How do you want to uh, promote that security is there? Uh, you know, one of the ways we do that is we built a platform that's very easy to use, so the best way to do it is to try it. So you can go to softlayer.com, do a backslash cloud, and you can actually try the cloud for yourself for 30 days. So I think that's the best education process, is just to get in there, drive the car, see how it feels, get comfortable with it, and then we're convinced that you'll, you'll want to stay there. Which product are you uh, especially proud of? Uh, we're especially proud of the hybrid environment and a thing we call Flex Images, which gives the ability to move from a dedicated server environment to a cloud environment, public or private, and back again. So you can take a copy of your image and replicate that globally on a, on a per usage basis or on a dedicated basis. And it gives customers that flexibility they need in the ability to migrate from existing systems onto our platform. So we're very proud of that. Yeah. What do you think are the most important trends for the future in the industry? One of the things I personally like is the open source movement. So we're using some, uh, we have object storage based on OpenStack. And I think we'll see a lot of innovation coming from open source because someone will develop some code. They open it up to the community so the community can develop code on top of that to suit their needs. And if that's integrated into platforms, then it's, it's better for everyone. So I have a, a personal preference for the, the open source movements. Thank you very much. My pleasure, thank you for having me.